trucked in the drought-stricken area of Mackinac, Kinango constituency in Kwale County, is a farmer who keeps livestock. Abdi Ibrahim has at least 16,000 goats and sheep that weigh between 35 to 50 kilograms. The farmer also has bulls that weigh up to 800 kilos that are exported to Oman and Mauritius. Francis Mutalaki caught up with him on his Mackinan feedlot farm as he prepares his second batch of over 15,000 goats and sheep for export to Oman. When Abdi Ibrahim completed his education over 18 years ago, he set off on a journey to fulfill his long-term passion, rearing livestock. For Abdi, livestock farming gives him a sense of completion. He has managed to scale up his venture on this 60-acre piece of land in Kilibasi village, a few meters off the Mombasa Nairobi Highway, rearing bulls for meat as well as goats and sheep. Kibata ukawa na nafasi kidogo na hii mfumo unaweza ifanya kwa sababu haitaki mambo mingi ni kuifungia tu ngombe zako na mbuzi zako mahali wapate leo pita wapate lishe bora maji wapatie then na wape dawa zile na stahili. This bull for example has been here for the last three months, feeding on modern methods of hay and other supplements and now weighs over 800 kilograms. Ibrahim says he can only sell it at 320,000 shillings at a rate of 400 shillings per kilo of meat. Weight gain yake kwa siku ni 2 to 2.5. Inategemea na ukubwa wa ngombe na frame yake. And ikiwa imekaa kama... Kawaida wa inatakani ikai mwezi tatu, three months to the maximum, ndo ikai kwa field lot, that's 90 days. So kwa wale ambao uzuri ili ngombe mba inezengia hapa iwe inengia na 350 to 400 ages. Ndo inakua ili ngombe mzuri kabisa mba uneza pata optimum weight. Next to it are over 16,000 goats and sheep, each weighing between 35 and 50 kilograms. Abdi began this last year when he has been exporting livestock to Mauritius. 15,000 of these are now heading to Oman, having left the port of Mombasa yesterday. Maybe in the next two days. Sahi tunatumia hei elfu moja, ambayo kila hei natugarimu shilingi mea tatu. Ikiwa tunasema kwa mpali ni laki tatu kwa hei peke yaki. Shortage of water and hei are some of the challenges. Abdi buys livestock from northern Kenya before feeding them for at least three months, helping them to gain up to two kilos per day before selling them. Mambo ya market. Ndo tunataka serikali ambaye iko na ambaye itakuja badae mwisho wa maka huu. Iangazia sana kwa mba tuipate beashara mingi kuliko kutagemea pingine inchi moja wa minchi bili. It is a dream that began 18 years ago. A dream that has now earned Amdi a deal of transporting livestock to Oman. Francis Mtilaki, Citizen TV, Makinon, Kuala County.